Hi everybody, my name is Gregory. I work at the Portola branch and I'm here to talk today about the book, Ursula K. Le Guin's book, The Left Hand of Darkness. Ursula K. Le Guin's The Left Hand of Darkness. Um, this book is pretty amazing because even though it was written about in almost 45 years ago, in 1969, it's a lot to kind of wrap your brain around. Sexuality is completely different from what it is today. Without giving too much away, there's no men or women on this planet, there's people of only one gender. An Earthling kind of from our planet goes to this place, Gethin. He's trying to get them to join a federation of planets, some very utopian standing experiment. Um, his main contact is this character named Estervin, who gets exiled from his own country, I guess his or her. Or, and then there's all these different kind of fairy tales, um, like folk tales from the planet, which just give you a lot of texture for the book. So Ursula K. Le Guin's science fiction isn't so much about like ray guns and, and different kinds of technology, which is also very cool kind of science fiction, but it's very socio-political and kind of like just mind experiments around how people might be different if their sexuality was completely different and kind of power relationships between people, attraction between people, how would that work out? I recommend it. I recommend it. It's a very satisfying read and I hope you try it out. There is attraction in the book, but it's, it's, you have to really like, look for it and you will find it at some point.